It hasn't even been a week since we last talked about Windsurf AI by Codium, and they've already released a couple of new updates. That makes the IDE even better. Before we even get to that, for the people who do not know, Windsurf IDE is a new AI editor that is an alternative to Cursor, but many new features. Windsurf takes AI-assisted coding to the next level with its proprietary context engine. It has the best ability to contextualize chat with your full code base, and it makes you have the ability to edit all of the files in one single area. Now, on top of all this, it's incredibly effective for complex multi-file projects by providing deep code understanding and context-aware edits across entire code bases. One of the main engines behind Windsurf AI is Cascade. This is a really cool new addition to Windsurf that lets you combine advanced AI with deep code base understanding to run production level code bases. And with Cascade, it's going to ensure that even on live projects, the AI can still provide highly relevant suggestions for debugging and code completion. You can easily run terminal command integration where you can suggest and run terminal commands and even debug and autocomplete. You have saved history as to where it will pick up your work exactly where you've left off. You also have multi-file editing, which is a feature that enables coherent and context-aware edits across multiple files. Now, the only main difference that we can see with Windsurf and Cursor is that Cursor doesn't have the capability to have full contextual awareness of the code base, whereas Windsurf does. And in terms of pricing, it is actually $20 a month, whereas Windsurf's pro plan is only $10 per month. And something cool to note is that today, one of the main developers behind Codium had just came out with an announcement saying that since today is Thanksgiving within America, they have given out a free trial extension to December 11th. So you have a lot of time to utilize this amazing application for free. And now today we have a lot of new updates that will definitely elevate this IDE even further. Starting off with the first new update, which is the new image upload feature, where you have the ability to upload images directly into the IDE, where you can share visual assets like wireframes, you have UI mockups, or even code screenshots, and you're going to be able to get generations observed based off the image upload feature. And this is something that I want you to take a look at, which is a demo video, and it will give you a good idea as to what you can do with it. So every great idea starts with a fantastic napkin drawing. So today we're gonna launch our new business, it's Airbnb for dogs. Let's launch this product. All right, so I just airdropped my napkin drawing into my MacBook. So I'm gonna go ahead and open that up, upload the image, let's just say implement this Airbnb for dogs landing page using this sketch. Okay, so it just finished generating. Let's see what we get. Holy cow. Look at that. We just built a billion dollar business using Windsurf's new image upload feature. Another new feature is that Anthropic has introduced the model context protocol, which is an open standard designed that will connect AI systems with diverse data sources, such as content repositories, you have tools, development environments, and it basically aims to overcome the limitations of fragmented integrations by providing a universal protocol. And it's going to be something that will have and allow AI models to produce more relevant and context-aware responses. And what they've basically done with the Windsurf team is that they have implemented this standard where they have it so that it's going to be able to provide a collaboration that will enhance the IDE's capability by allowing it to pull real-time data. It's going to be able to improve code suggestion, debugging, and even project documentation handling. All of this will enable a dynamic knowledge integration with this new MCP update from Anthropic. And all of this will help you streamline collaboration and even improve multi-file editing. What's wild to me is that you have the ability to use the Cloud 3.5 sauna model unlimitedly, meaning that there is no restriction of usage within Windsurf to access this model, which is just nuts to me. Imagine how much they're spending to have this operational for thousands of users. Now let's get started and showcase all of these features in detail. So what I want you guys to do, if you guys do not have Codium installed or Windsurf installed, go ahead to this link in the description below. 
click on download and this will install it for your operating system now for the people who have already installed it what you guys will need to do is you need to restart to update to the newest version so simply go ahead and click on this blue button on the top right panel and this will basically start up installing the new update for windsurf once it's installed you will now be able to access the image upload feature so if you are to go back into cascade you can see that you can now access the add image feature so if you are to click on this you can then use it as context and start chatting with it now another big update i want to mention is that there was actually a lot of bugs which is kind of expected for a new product and they are slowly rolling out with a lot of fixes these random buggy mistakes that you would see with the cascade features with the context and so many other areas so they're slowly going ahead and fixing all of these different bugs but essentially with the new mcp being integrated into windsurf with the new addition of the image feature we have a new powerful ide even better than what we saw last week here is a rough schematic of a wireframe and you can see it's for a SaaS website or sorry an e-commerce website and what i'm going to be doing is taking this wireframe and having windsurf basically develop it so let's go ahead and test this out so i've went along and i've provided a prompt as well as the image so let's go ahead and send this in i basically had requested it to take the wireframe of the product page and replicate it and just basically configure it based off my own needs so for the people who haven't seen this before you can see right away that it's going to go ahead and basically do what composer does which is capable of executing terminal based commands you also have inline editing where you can view all the changes being made autonomously and you can basically go ahead and then even accept it you can also open the diff to see where the changes are being made and where the files are being created once all the changes are made you can go ahead and click on accept all and then we can start up this application so i can go ahead to the project files i can then open this up and right away i can see that it did a great job in replicating everything from that wireframe and it did a great job in also adding animations you can change colors as well as choosing the size and you can even see that there's a size guide now this was something that i was capable of just fully generating by simply providing windsurf the image and it was capable of generating all the code the styling for it now if you haven't seen my previous video on windsurf i definitely recommend that you do so because i was capable of creating a lot of cool things like i was able to build out this nutrition tracking application where you can add your goals as well as adding various meals and you can simply go ahead and also build out full games like this 2048 game that is fully functional you can click on new game and you can actually play this and this is the capability that you get with windsurf but that's essentially it for today's new update video on windsurf i'll leave all the links that i use in today's video in the description below but i hope you enjoyed and you got some sort of value out of it now make sure you follow me on the patreon as well as on the twitter page so that you can stay up to date with the latest ai news and lastly make sure you guys subscribe turn on the notification bell like this video and check out our previous videos so you can stay up to date with whatever is happening in the world of ai but with that thought guys, have an amazing day, spread positivity, and I'll see you guys fairly shortly. Peace out fellas.